Hi everyone, this is Evia Tukesada and I try to film on my phone because I'm trying to, um, what do you call it, I'm trying to get more, um, I'm trying to raise my time limit on the videos. So, supposedly I can do that through using my mobile device. So I'm trying a video on my phone to see if this really works to get more than the 10 minutes that I'm allowed right now. That way I don't have to rush through things and do the part ones and part twos and whatever. So let's get a try and see how it works. Uh, for that video, what I'm gonna do is to show you what I bought yesterday when I went to get the flowers for the little headpiece for my daughter, which by the way, she really, really liked, and I'm so happy that she liked it. She said, it's so pretty, and that like, Ah, I just, I was so happy. So anyways, let me go into this so you guys can see what I found yesterday. I'm so thrilled that I found these things here. I finally got to the store I wanted to go. And um, this is one of the flowers that I found. Let me see if I can open this a little. No, I'm not even going to attempt to open this with all the noise and the phone. But this is one of them. You can see it pretty well there. It has like two different um, layers and then the little... Um, rhinestone in the center. So those are in an off-white. Then I bought the same calla lilies that I got for the white ones that I had gotten. I got them in a cream color. I found the little tiny roses in white so I can play with my lilies. I got this other side. And this is like that side. And then I found these tiny ones. So those are the roses that I found. Then I found the oops, totally our thing. I found these. I don't know what you call these flowers. Is it chrysanthemum or whatever? That that little pretty flower. I got it in like yeah, it's not too big. It's teeny tiny, but they're so cute. I got them in the pink, I found them in the purple, and I found them in the this aqua color. Actually, I found them in other colors, but these are the ones that I bought. <laughs> I would have bought in the, but I would have bought the whole store because they had so many pretty things. But you know, I couldn't go that crazy, so I found these other roses. They're like an organza rose, and it has like little sprays in it with like glittery and I don't know they're pretty they're really pretty so I got that in white and I also got them in this light blue and then I also bought this they also had in a couple colors but I just got this it's like a salmon um, pink salmon pink so it has a satin ribbon rose in the center and those little stamens, is that what you call it? The little pearl things that you put in the middle. And then there is um, an, like another layer of, it has like three layers. It's like a satin and a ganza and then another type of fabric in the back. So three layers for that rose. And I'm sorry, I'm really like in an uncomfortable position to open them and I don't want to make a whole bunch of noise. So, and I think I just broke my little trash can that I in. <laughs> But anyways, um, these are other flowers that I found. These are acrylic. So it's a clear acrylic and the center is a pearl. Pretty sure you can see. And they had it in a couple colors, but I got the last clear white ones that they had. I would have gotten more of this um, clear ones, but that's what this was the last pack they had of that. And then they had a whole bunch of lace, but it was really expensive. I mean, the ones that I liked and I grabbed to buy loose, they were like three and four dollars a yard. And I just I wanted to get other things and not spend it on lace. So this is the only one I did buy it, but I bought the whole um, bulk of it because I really liked it. It's a cream color, and it has the crochet detail with the satin ribbon 
palm thread it through. Really, really pretty. And they had a whole bunch of other um, different types of laces and trims, but they were kind of expensive, so I've been buying a couple of things lately, and I need to hold off on that, so I'm sure I'll be going back as soon as I have some money again, and um, I hope this little trial of a video helps me increase my time for my video so that when I do the long hauls, I don't have to keep breaking them into part one and part two, and you can just pause them and look at them whenever you get a chance. So anyways, thank you so much. Everyone, thanks for all the kind and sweet comments about um, the video on the piece that I did for my daughter. And I just want to let you all know that she loved it. So I'm super thrilled that um, it worked out and she really liked it. So I'll see you soon. And oh, let me show you one more thing. Now if I have the extra time, let me, let's see if I don't break this. I, I also stopped at another place. I was getting something for her first communion, and I stopped. I don't know if you guys know of this story for the first. Probably, I mean, you probably know about it, but it's called Charlotte Rouge. And I went in to see if I could find some like um, costume jewelry at like really nice prices that I could like break apart and use. And they had the rack for the rings and the bracelets and earrings for five dollars each. They were reduced to that. So this is a really, really bad, bad light with all the, I can't really, I don't know if you can see, but I got this ring, which is just like the stretchy kind. So I'm thinking of taking that back part off and use this as a brooch for a little accent. There's so much glare here. We'll end this song. I got this bracelet with a turquoise in the middle, and I... I'm thinking of it's it's actually beautiful. I don't I don't know if I'm, I have the heart to break it because I really like the bracelet, but I also love these pieces individually. So I don't know. Maybe I'll go back and get another one to use in pieces, and I'll keep this one because I actually really like it. <laughs> and then I also found these bracelets. And there are crochet balls, and I want to like use these for charms on projects and albums. So I bought that. And I actually got two of them. I'm sharing one of them with someone. <laughs> and then, ooh, these are all tangled. Let me see. This is another ring that has the turquoise and the crystals and like in between really pretty way too big for my hand skinny long fingers but perfect for taking this off and using that as a brooch or an accent piece on a project so got that and these earrings which bend in the middle like this this part and this part they're both hard surfaces but i figure i could also use this as a charm on a project. So that's going into my little accent um, vault. And this other one I can't untangle, so I'm not going to take too much time with it. But this is another ring. Ooh, the lighting's perfect on that one. So, yeah, another one of those rings. Another top that I could use for something else. So that's the other one that I got. And then I found these earrings which are, and, uh, oops, now they untangle, now they need them to untangle, they untangle. So I found these earrings, and um, I love the colors on them. I love the design on it. Wouldn't wear it on my ear, because they're too big for my style, but I love it as a pendant on something. So I got them, and now I have two pendants that I can use as charms or anything. I would like to use them for so another piece to alter and yeah and this one I already showed so those were my finds at that other store and if these work out I'm sure I'll be looking for more things to play with and take apart and for the first time instead of doing or making jewelry I'll be taking it apart and using it in other things so anyways thanks again for watching um, 
I hope you come on back come back and visit soon. I think it's um my mouth is running faster than my mind or something. I my must be way too tired. Getting ready for another tough weekend work. So <clears throat> I hope to see you soon. Thank you so much for watching again and take care everyone. Bye.